I'm kind of excited to be riding Graham Swamp today. The last place in Florida that I'm really wanting to ride. I may hear of some other places that are worth the drive for me, but this one is, I think, the last one that I'm uh, really anxious to hit because I've heard some good things about it. I'll let you know how it goes. Looks like it's one directional, and it looks like from Trail Forks, this is the way we're supposed to go. My first time here, I'm anxious to see what we got going on. Nice little warm up jumps out here, getting you ready for whatever is to come. Looks like that's probably the trail that we're going to get on. Uh, yeah, this is the only place in Florida <clears throat> that I haven't ridden yet that I've heard good things about, with the exception of the Grapefruit Trail. I've heard good things about it, but I probably am not going to drive down there because that's closer to Miami and I've already been down there to do Markham Park. So I definitely should have hit that when I was down that way, but I missed it. Uh, some may be wondering why I'm not riding so much in Florida. Well, my son and daughter-in-law live in Gainesville now and I have a new granddaughter so I'm coming to see her and of course my son and daughter-in-law as well. They live in Gainesville, so I've got part of that drive already knocked out coming down into Florida. They used to live in Austin, Texas, so took that opportunity to ride Spider Mountain and Reveal Peak Ranch and taught in Austin proper at a trail system. I don't remember the name of it. Uh, and it was like 110 degrees. Oh my gosh, Let's see what we got here. Mandatory, yeah, mandatory drop, no roll there. Have to hit that next time around. Uh, but yeah, that was right around the time of when COVID started really ramping up and i remember they actually closed the closed the park oh that's a nice little double they closed the park and uh we had to leave the park and go and learn underneath a interstate bridge so there's your memory this is super cool i've seen some videos of this um trail builders put a lot of time on this alternate technical line Appreciate the fact that they worked on it instead of just building the trail around it. That way, uh, riders of different skill levels can have fun. You can have a beginner rider come through here, or you can have an advanced rider. Um, they're both having fun, so let's check it out. Uh, we hit it backwards since since nobody's here today. I don't think anybody's going to mind if I hit it backwards. Seems like there are a lot of Florida mountain bikers though. The reels I've posted from Alafaya State Park down near Tampa, they've probably gotten more views than just about any of my um, any of my reels, exception of maybe one or two from uh, Bentonville. But that's crazy, man, that there are so many riders in Florida. I don't think there's as many out that come from outside the state, but it's very popular in parts of Florida, pockets of Florida. This would be a good one to hit with Santos. So if you wanted to hit Santos and then swing over and hit this one, be a nice trip from Alabama and probably the closest Florida trails. Um, swing down and hit one or the other first depending on the weather i guess and uh but if you can only take 
one trip to Florida to ride, I still love Alifaya the most. It's a little further away down towards Tampa. And then you can also hit Carter Road. So that would be the best trip. But if you don't have as much time for driving, a short trip but a fun trip would definitely be here, Graham Swap, so from what I've seen so far. And uh Santos near Ocala, Ocala. I don't know how you say it. So far I would just uh describe this trail as a, a cross country trail a fun cross country trail but it's definitely a cross country trail there are a lot of fun jumps here some of them are really really well built like this one you just climb up this trail right here you go in the direction that recommends on uh, trail forks you round the corner up there you just let off your brakes and give a couple pedal strokes right at the top and you have the perfect amount of speed to clear it. So well built. You can come up a little short, you'll be fine. Put some concrete down there to help the erosion pro problem. Just so well built, so much fun. Way to go, Graham Swap. Don't touch the brakes, woo hoo hoo. <laughs>